All right, check this out. You guys are back on the Hater World and I'm Blue Devil. What we have going on today is Leela Cakes versus Crip Mac Part 2. The saga continues. In this video here, you got Leela Cakes homeboys inside of Crip Mac's home drinking his old English. But before we get into this video, if you guys are new to the Hater World, make sure you go over, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, like the video, and most importantly, leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you guys like what I'm doing or whether you don't. Salute to all the day ones. Salute to all the new subscribers. You guys already know nothing but love. But check this out. Check this out. If you guys want to talk to me, send me videos, hit me up about business, be a sponsor, hit me up on Instagram at The Hater World. Uh, and also find us on all social media websites, platforms, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, TikTok, TikTok, Rumble. Uh, Spotify, Apple Music, you name it, we there, right? Sometimes there's a QR code that pops up on the screen. Just scan it. It'll take you to all the sites. Uh, other than that, today is 4th of July. Happy 4th of July to everybody out there. We do got a uh, 200 Boys podcast, episode 17, sometime after 6 p.m., so make sure you guys tune in. Other than that, don't forget, this is part two of the Leela Cakes versus Crip Max. So if you haven't watched part one, Click somewhere around here, go back to the page, and find part one. All right? So with no further ado, let's go ahead and watch this video and get you guys a Southsiders reaction. Let's get it. How many beers in that motherfucker? It's me, though, cuz. I don't know what you're talking about. Take all of them off. All right, the guy in the video right here, if you guys recall, I think it was last year, uh, this fool was beefing with Nina Boy, right? Uh, and they were going to do a boxing match or they were going to meet up in the hood or some shit like that. Remember uh, Nina Boy got a DP? It was because of this dude right here. Well, this dude right here is inside of Crip Max home. He just cracked open one of Crip Max Old Englishes, the, the drink, the beer, Old English. Uh, it's about to sip that down. And to tell you the truth, I don't know how to feel. Because when you're the enemy, it's fair game. Except for family and kids, right? Women and kids. But when you're the enemy, it's fair game. Let's keep listening. Hey, hold on. That fool said, I don't know where your mouth been, so I'm gonna pour it in the cup. My boy, you just cracked it open. Is you slow? I don't think he licking the cans and, and, and drinking out of a can that's not open, homie. Get it together, my boy. Eastside shit. Eastside shit. Listen, that 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 fucking hood right in the back, Eastside shit, is the one that's pumping all this up. Listen, my guys, homies got to be smarter than this. Letting a girl, letting a girl pin homies against homies, even if they're not from the same gang, they from the same area, right? And even if they're not from the same area, they're both, you know, gang related motherfuckers, right? And you guys are letting a female. Pump everyone up. How you gonna let a female pump you up to do some shit? Come on, homie. Like, motherfuckers gotta be smarter than this shit. Let's go. Hey, hey bro, when you crash out, where you, where you and your bitch sleeping at? You my bed. Oh, God. Hey, look, I got fresh blankets and all that for y'all. That bitch is doing it on purpose. She said, where are you guys gonna sleep at? That fool said, on Crip Mac's bed. Listen, quick little message to Crip Mac. Fuck this house. Don't go back to the house, homie. Don't go. Listen, do not go back to the house. Whatever you left behind, you can buy new shit. Fuck that house. That house is going to get you in the wreck, homie. Listen, you're going to go back there. And somebody going to say some stupid shit, whether it's her, whether them dudes are going to pull up. And you're going to get in the wreck because you're going to have to, you know. 
Pull out the fire stick. You don't need that shit. These people ain't worth it, my boy. You got too much shit cracking. Piece of advice. That piece of ass ain't shit. Let her get somebody else in the wreck. These fools right here, they're looking for clout. You know, stay away. Elevate. Uh, sorry. Stay away. Uh, elevate. Feel me? Let's keep going. Yankee, what it is? Let me let me see that yank. Let me see that yank. Yeah, that part. That's that's my little brother. This my little brother too. You feel me? Fuck one on east side neighborhood, nigga. Before all that shit on the west side, nigga. I'm a real Raymond Washington baby, nigga. Hey, what you mean? Hey, when you saw that, when you saw that um east side shit, what happened? I'm like, look, check this out. Hold up. Hold the fuck up. Like, what the fuck going on? They gonna whoop you. They gonna whoop you. DSC, man. Hold on. <laughs> now, where my bill at? <laughs> I'm gonna take them up. Yo, hey, bro, I'm gonna take I'm gonna... The liquor is talking. Beer balls. The liquor is talking. All over a fucking fat torta. This is fucking sickening, bro. This is weird. These are what you call fatherless, uh, uh, fatherless activities, bro. Even for the men, my boy. Even for the motherfucking men, these fools were raised by women. How you out here acting a fool over a fucking three hundred and fifty pounder, a uh, five one, oompa loompa. Fuck, man. There's so much shit to say, but I'm going to just stay quiet. Let's keep going. Fuck you. Yeah. Oh, hush this nigga. Yeah. No, me, me, me. Hey, look. If, if, I ain't, if I ain't right here in the morning, in the morning waking up in your bed, I'm on City Second Street Club between Main and Pizza. Nah, nigga, we good. So, look, we going we gonna to take some breakfast out tomorrow. We're making a brunch at Mimosa. You feel me? We doing this shit. Hey, they pull up gang strong. They pull up guys strong, so we gonna wait for them niggas to pull up though. You feel me? They talk about they about to sock a bitch out, slap me and shit. All kind of shit. They talk about fuck, fuck, fuck the hood and shit. Like niggas. We are. I think I think what Lily Cakes is talking about. There's a video of ODM Slim at the amusement park with China Mac. You know, on the phone disrespecting someone. I'm gonna look for it. And I'm gonna try to react to it. Lily Cakes, how old are you? I don't know, probably late 20s, early 30s. You got to entertain that bullshit? Aren't you smart enough to say Crip Mac is drunk or fucking stupid or slow or whatever? I ain't going to listen to this shit. Bitch, you entertaining that shit like you believe that shit. Listen, you could say age got a lot to do with it because at, at, at a young age, I was also doing some dumb shit, careless Thinking everything was a joke, not caring, you know, you know, playing with fire, playing with death, you know, uh, and nobody could tell me nothing. So I understand. And maybe because I'm older now, I'm like, I don't entertain bullshit. I'll laugh at it. You know, it's just like that Cholo guy. You know, I had a good time with him. You know, pause, no homo. You know what I mean? I, I, I clown them and, you know, speak to the wall. I don't give a fuck, you know. Uh, oh, I want to fight you. My boy, keep talking to the wall. You're not worthy, you know, uh, and now maybe that's why, because I'm a little older, so I look at things different, but the all these guys right here, they look like they're in their 30s, so it's like, it, your priorities ain't right, my boy, you over there worrying about Crip Mac and this, this, and that, and Leela Cakes is starting this big old war or this drama, you know, eventually somebody's big homie's going to get involved and shut all this shit down, all over what? Some fucking hood rat? Let's keep going. East side babies over here, you feel me? That real East side shit. Neighborhood. Neighborhood East Coast side shit, you feel me? Yeah, that part. It's, it's like 1980, cuz. We pour this shit out, cuz. My nigga nigga from Six Juice, you feel me? This how the fuck I feel about your drink, cuz. And the five nines on y'all head. All of them, you feel me? This how I feel about your drink, you bitch ass nigga. Yeah. Mexican body ass. <laughs> Mexican body ass nigga. Look, look, hey. Check this out, Mr. What do you say? Mexican body? 
Let me see. Mexican body. Mexican body. This how I feel about your drink, you bitch ass nigga. Yeah. Mexican body ass. <laughs> Mexican body ass nigga. Hey. Mexican body ass N I G G A. Somebody tell me what that means. I don't know what that means. Mexican body N I G G A. Is that a diss towards Mexicans? Let's keep going. My nigga nigga from five nine. You feel me? Yeah. Real nigga. You feel me? We pouring this shit out, so we gonna go get some rainbow. That part. It's cool when they do it. It's probably when I do it. But Cloud is one hell of a drug. <laughs> Nigga over there drinking rock gas. <laughs> this bitch is talking so much shit about Crip Mac, but yeah, there's videos of them boning. There's videos of them on OnlyFans. I haven't watched them. I don't want to watch them, but I've heard about it. Uh, there's videos of them kissing, you know, uh, sharing food, sleeping together. You name it, my boy. Listen, this bitch is two-faced. You know, she's a man. She's a man. Uh, to all the homies, stay away from females like this. I'll say it again. I said it all last video. Stay away from females like this. She is a man. You cannot have two men in the relationship. You need to have a woman and a man. It will never work with a female that acts like a man. Even if Crip Mac does argue with her, you would think that she would just sip it up and be a lady. But nah, she wants to be vindictive and get, get the last word, bro. And everything you've done, she's the type of woman, bro, where everything you've done for her means nothing because of this moment right here. Unappreciative people, toxic people, narcissistic people. Stay away from this fucking garbage. This is grade A dumpster juice. It doesn't get no worse than this. Instead of talking to Crip Mac like, hey, my boy, you're my homie, you're my friend. You know, even though you're disrespecting me, I'm, I'm going to act like a lady. I'm going to tell you to stop. The first thing she does is run to get all these fucking dudes to come into his house, disrespect him, drink his shit, and sleep in his bed. Man, this is a type of bitch that will get you killed or get you to kill someone. I don't ever want to be around people like that. I already been, and it's a no-no for me. If I'm going to do some stupid shit, it's going to be because of something I do. Not because of somebody else's bullshit that I got to react to. If I got to react to some shit you did, I'd rather stay away from you. If I'm going to murk somebody or do something to somebody, it, I want it to be uh, based off of how I feel, not how you're making me feel. Fuck that. Prisons are full of fucking crash dummies and retards. So when you got people in the comments like... Hey, Blue Devil, you gonna respond to this guy? Shut the fuck up. You can't get me to reply. I'll reply if I feel like it. Well, you're looking soft. Yeah, and you're looking like a bitch. Something else? Keep going. Change the fucking, uh, change the, the, the page. You can't fool me. Let's keep going. <laughs> nigga, nigga, you might as well drink some talk about this. My name ain't Belton, so they know what it is, too. I ain't all. This shit got gold on, bro. What are you doing? Oh, God. But he really know my name ring. He really know my name ring bills out here. This fool threw away $8 worth of beer and feels like he did some gangster ass shit. And listen, I'm not backing up Crip Mac. I don't even know the motherfucker. I'm just, you know me. I narrate and I tell you what I see. Whether it's some sucker shit or some real shit. You know, and, you know, it might be a win for the homie in the yellow because he's, he's inside of the biggest, biggest crip for 2023. And I mean on the Internet, right? I know it on the streets, Crip Mac is not the, you know, biggest crip, you know. Uh, but a lot of times, bro, a lot of homies might be looking at Crip Mac like, man, he ain't with the shit. Why he got millions of views? That fool not down like me. Fuck him. And that, that's what it looks like right here. That fool in the yellow seems sort of jealous. Maybe because he's more gangster, done more things. So he feels like that fool's not on my level. You know, but come on, my boy. You you, you threw away $8 worth of beer. You should have left it there for that man. And then you got fucking uh, Oompa Loompa saying that my name rings bells out here. It probably does. 
It probably does, but I mean, is it something to be proud of? Come on. This is what you call killer pussy. Go back to Masterpiece album, The Ice Cream Man, and go listen to the song Killer Pussy. Okay? And if anybody don't know who Master P is, go type up Master P Ice Cream Man, the album. And I think it might be track 18 or 19, Killer Pussy. That's what this is. Let's keep going. You done fucked my whole drink on with this bullshit. Yeah. He really know my name ring bells out here in these streets. Like, I'm a real east side, oh. south central ass yeah. fucking bitch. You feel me? Like, I got people from everywhere. You a hood rat. I got people from all neighborhoods. You feel me? I was yeah. born and raised into this shit. 76, Price Street, 596 Deuce. You feel me? Yeah, that part. That part. That part. We stay, we stay outside, though. The, the, ask about them 11 deuces. Ask about the 11 deuces. Yeah. We them niggas. Ask about Jenny Craig. Ask about them weight loss programs. Ask about them uh, empowering to change your life programs. Ask about a fist, uh, 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 a trainer. Come on, get, man, listen. None of, none of the, nothing she said is impressive. Nothing she said is impressive. You know a lot of people because you in the hood. Everybody that lives in the hood knows everybody. Everybody. Let's keep going. <clears throat> See, this is what happens when Chris. Listen, Crip Mac, fuck this house. Trust me, stay away. Do your thing. Success, success is the best revenge. You making a bag, you you surpassing all these people, you continuing to work hard, you continuing to be out here hustling will make these people die of jealousy. You know, stooping to their level and doing what they do and saying what they say will get you nowhere. Leave that for the homies that want to do it for you. Because I know you probably got homies around you that are waiting and itching to handle something for you. Leave that for them. All right? Other than that, to all the homies watching, stay away from females like this. Whether she look good or she don't. Because there's females that look bomb as fuck and act like this. So it don't matter how they look, stay away. You know, warning, stay away. But other than that, uh, catch today's podcast, 200 Boys, episode 17, sometime after 6 p.m. Make sure you stay tuned for that. Uh, and if you haven't watched part one of this, go watch it. I'm going to try to release a third part today, which is the ODM uh, arguing with somebody on the phone. I think it is Leela Cakes. So make sure you look out for that. Other than that, follow us on our clips page, Hater World Clips. I'm going to leave it down below. If not, it'll be at the end. The little world, click on it. It'll take you there. Go subscribe. Run the numbers up. Uh, let me know you subscribed. Uh, and I do want to do some giveaways pretty soon, so we're going to get that cracking. But other than that, I'm going to kill this video. We're laying. Call it a day. Once again, I'm Blue Devil. This has been a Hater World production, and we out.